Hi all, welcome to my channel, welcome to my world, this is the world of Wayne and we've gone through all the DeLoreans this month, we're time to jump over to Diagostini and a completely different franchise, we got the Diagostini Star Wars Build Your Own R2-D2. Okay peeps, we are on issue 17, so let's, without further ado, let's see what this looks like. Uh, here's the magazine here. Uh, little bits and pieces about some of the villains and the uh, it's like Boba Fett here. Um, all about Boba Fett. Uh, more about the droids, stuff like that. Uh, this is the bit that we're getting to though. What we've actually got to do. Now this is only coming with three parts and I don't even think we're going to be doing any of these electrics. So theoretically, it's only one part. Um, by the look of it, we're fitting one part to uh, the dome. Or two parts to the dome. Two parts to the dome, well, one part to the dome. That's it, that's all we're gonna be doing. So uh, what we do then is uh, we'll bring this a lot. This is the dome here, look. Uh, can you see that? There you go. Uh, I'm gonna take it off this little stand that it's on, uh, just so you can see it a little bit better. There we go, and that's looking just like that. And uh, I'm guessing the next bit's gonna be going uh, somewhere, probably on the right hand side of this here, uh, from the top there. It's going to go on here, but I don't know because I'm going to look at the instructions. So uh, let's see what they have to hold. Uh, this is the pack of goodies that we've got here, issue 17. So uh, get these open. Right, uh, it, we definitely aren't using the wires uh, in this one here. So uh, I'm going to keep those to one side for a minute. Uh, and all we have got is just this little bit here. That's it. Just this little bit over here, which is going to go... Uh, pretty easy enough, just to the right hand side. Hold on, let me just see. Uh, as a matter of fact, no, they're... Yeah, they're putting it on this side. Yeah, that is right. <laughs> Worry me then for the pictures. So that's going to fit in there like that. Uh, just with the usual nuts that we used last time. Uh, I've got my nuts, I'm just put this to one side, just up here. Um, I've still got them left over from when I built the uh, R2-D2. And obviously we know that they are the smaller nuts, these ones here, and the smaller of the silver screws. Um, they haven't gave us any more screws in this, just so you know. And the only screws I've got left are these ones here, so it's definitely gonna be these. And I think I'm gonna need three of them by the look of it. So three of them and I'll just tip all the nuts out because, uh, you know, we don't care. <laughs> okay, so let's get this on where it goes. So uh, as we know, it's gonna be going on this section just like that there fitting on perfectly and it's going to be the same thing before we're going to hold the uh, nut in with our finger just like that and then the bolt is going to be going through uh, oh cool this is going to be a bit fiddly let's have a look at that I'm going to hold it in my finger which is just falling out let's try that again Put the nut in, nuts in. Right, the bolt is going to be going into the metal, and this is going to be a little bit tricky to put on unless uh, I might have to magnify my screwdrivers up again. Because I think, yeah, this is going to be a little bit tricky if you haven't magnified your screwdriver up. Because yeah, these little holes here are quite deep in the unit here. And the second time I've just tried there, it's just fallen out again. So let's have one last time. Right, I think I have got a magnetic one. Let's try it with my magnetic. Here we go. I've used my Back to the Future one here. Yeah, if you haven't got a magnetic screwdriver, <laughs> you're going to be in for some problems. <laughs> okay, that's the first one in. And the second one. Oh, it is only two bolts that are holding this in. Two nuts and bolts that are holding this in. So again, I'm going to use my trusty, trusty Eagle Moss uh, screwdriver to pick these things up and put them in. <laughs> Perhaps I'll just use that for everything. Uh, just gonna make sure that that's nice and flush there. And that's it. That is all we've had to do. Issue 17. Now, if you would have paid, I've got to check this again. Look, you're paying uh, £8.99 for this. That would have taken you about five minutes. So, uh, not a lot to do. It's not still heavy on my head. <laughs> uh, let's see what's in the next issue. Next issue, we've got more of this building the helmet and stuff like that. And uh, a little bit more of the electrics and stuff like that. 
bear with me because you see even though there's not much to do here you just know that later on in the build there's going to be a hell of a lot to do and unfortunately we've got to get the boring stuff out of the way before we can get into the really exciting stuff which is the electrics and stuff like that so that will be coming uh, and that's probably coming in either 18 19 20 or 21 which i've got to do shortly but uh other than that that's all we've had to do apart from that we could uh, stick it on the stand i guess and let it spin take care